Yo, 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 it's your boy Alex Witherspoon, man. Look, you know you got the right team. We got all of the right tools and you know it's the right time. It's 11, 12. So today, just been such a beautiful day, man. Was able to spend time with my family. Actually able to bring a word to the nursing home. My first time ever physically being able to bring a good word to them. But um, the most important thing is, man, us getting into the word of God. And I want to read to y'all Revelations chapter 3, verse 8. And it says this, I know thy works. Behold, I have set before thee an open door, and no man can shut it. For thou hast a little strength, and hast kept my word, and has not denied my name. Listen, man, when you know, you know. You know, a lot of times people can be like, hey, I'm doing this for the Lord. I'm walking with the Lord. But I know my true walk and my true calling with, with Jesus Christ and how I'm moving with him. And I've been very patient. And I've been just waiting on him to do all of the great things. I've been telling my family, I've been telling the people around me that I love, like, listen, a great thing is coming. A great thing is about to happen. And it's not always monetary. It's not always about how much money or uh, doing this or doing that. God is doing a new thing right now. And I don't know if you're under the sound of my voice and you're feeling it too, man, but I know God is doing something great. He's allowing us to become. He's bringing um, a new mantle to you. And I believe that wholeheartedly. And I'm just asking God, not for material things, but for me to be able to walk into what he wants me to walk into. And that could just be me giving the word or sharing somebody some information to get them closer to Jesus Christ, to help somebody get saved. Let's seek ye first the kingdom of heaven and his righteousness and all these other things that be added. Like when you walk in with God and you seek in the kingdom and you seek in building his people, man, what else is there? There's nothing else you can, you can need or want because he's going to provide it all. And he's just providing us with the information. He's providing us with the word. He's providing us with a word to say. So the, the door is being open for you. If you walk with God, the door is being open for you right now. All you have to do is receive and believe. You know, Abraham, he believed. And God counted that toward his righteousness. So number one, let's believe. Let's really believe. Let's really have faith. Let's really move in a way that's prosperous and productive. I got something I wrote down the other day. I'm going to get shared with y'all. This is something that I've seen. I'd like to share it. And it's talking about becoming. It says your belief becomes your thoughts. Your thoughts become your words. Your words become your actions. Your actions become your habits. And your habits become your values. And your values becomes your destiny. We destined to be children of God. We destined to be a part of this kingdom. And so once you start aligning your will and your way with his will and his way, and you start understanding what God is expecting of you, what God is saying you are, and where God is taking you. That's all about reading the word and understanding what God is, who he is, and what he's doing. So I just wish y'all the best, man. I just want y'all to be your very best you. Step into your very best, most productive version of yourself. And that open door that he's opening for you, walk through it. And he'll provide everything that's on the other side. It's your time, man. It's 11-12. Message.